Hi children, welcome to class today. Let's continue our lesson with the addition and subtraction involving time. Okay, let's look at example 1. We have 1 over 3 hours plus 1, 5 over 6 hours. As you can see, we have two fractions with different denominator. Okay, so find the common denominator. Okay, we will have 2 over 6 hours. Okay, then 1, 5 over 6 hours, we split it to 1 hour and 5 over 6 hours. Okay, now add the fraction, we'll get 1 plus 7 over 6 hours. Okay, as you can see, 7 over 6 is an improper fraction. So, convert to mixed number, you'll get 1, 1 over 6. Okay, so 1 plus 1 over 6 hours, you'll get 2, 1 over 6 hours. Okay, let's see the next example. We have 1 over 3 hours plus 50 minutes. Okay, so convert 1 over 3 hour to minutes. How do we convert? Okay, yes, multiply with 60. So you'll get 20 minutes. Now, 20 minutes plus 15 minutes, the answer will be 70 minutes. Okay, now let's see example 3. 2, 1 over 2 years or 2 and a half years plus 5 years 9 months okay as you can see we have a fraction here so convert the fraction to year and month so two and a half year okay you will get two years and six months okay now to add them do a t line then write month and year add month with month and year with year six plus nine you'll get fifteen 2 plus 5, you'll get 7. Now you can see we have 15 months. In a year, we only have 12 months. So take out 12 from 15. Okay, you minus 15 minus 12, you'll get 3. Okay, then add the 12 month to year. Okay, so 12 months is 1 year. So we add 1 to year. Now we will get... 8 years and 3 months. Okay, next example 1.25 years plus 3, 5 over 6 year. Now your answer must be in year and month. So convert 1.25 years to years and month. Okay, once you convert, you'll get 1 year, 3 months. Then, 5 over 6 years, convert to months. Okay, so multiply with 12, you'll get 10 months. Okay, now add 1 year, 3 months to 10 months. Okay, you'll get 1 year, 13 months. Okay, in a year, there are only 12 months. So, take 12 from 13. Okay, you'll have 1 month. And 12 months, when you bring to a year, you plus 1. So, your answer will be 2 years, 1 month. The next example will be 8 centuries, 7 decades, minus 2, 4, or 5 centuries. Okay, first, convert the fraction of time. Okay, 2, 4, or centuries. Okay, convert, you'll get 2 centuries and 8 decades. Now, you'll have 8 century 7 decades minus 2 century 8 decades. Okay, do a T line. Okay. Look at the decades. Okay, you have 7 minus 8. Since you cannot minus, take 1 century and give 2 decades. We will have 17 minus 8. Okay, 9 decades. Then, 7 centuries minus 2 centuries will have 5 centuries so your last answer will be five centuries and nine decades 
next example 9.75 days minus 3 days and 20 hours okay and your answer must be in day and hours okay convert 9.75 days to days and hours okay so once you convert you will get 9 days and 18 hours okay now you minus okay do a t line as you can see 18 cannot minus with 20 so take one from day and give to month okay you have to add with 24 so 18 plus 24 you'll get 42 so 42 minus with 20 you'll get 22 now once you take one from the day now the day will left to eat eight days okay so eight days minus with three days you'll get five so your answer will be five days and 22 hours okay children we'll end our lesson today we'll meet again bye